Welcome back to Real Extreme Fishing. Today we're gonna to be fishing down here at a creek. I've never fished this creek before. I actually was trying to fish a new spot on the river. It was just chocolate milk. So I'm not even gonna show you any clips from that. Nothing real exciting, but it did look super juicy. So once that water clears up in a couple weeks, I'm probably gonna give that spot another try. But like I said today, guys, we're gonna be fishing this creek. Not even sure if there's fish in it, but hopefully there will be so. Stay tuned. I'll show you the lure we're gonna to use today. This is, this right here is a Nico Caddis fly. We have that rigged up with a 164 ounce mule jig head. So we're gonna give this a shot. This is a multi-species lure, so. Not sure if I wanna go upstream or downstream today. Let's see how deep it is under this bridge. Make our way down there. A little hole right here, kind of. Right by the edge of that rock right there. Yeah, it's not looking very good so far here. We'll keep, we'll keep moving upstream. I'm not seeing any fish other than minnows. So there's a calm area here, but it's just all shallow. If that was deep, that would definitely hold fish. From here, it doesn't look deep. There is a bend up around there, maybe. Just maybe. Sun's starting to peek through, so that might help. Yeah, this is deep. This has some depth to it right here. Let's see. Yeah, this has some depth, guys. Come on, fishies. This is definitely the best spot so far that I've come to on the creek. If I don't get bit here, there's nothing in this creek. I mean, we got structure, we got a bunch of rock piles right in the center of the creek here. There's no reason a fish shouldn't be here. All right, we're switching things up. Lost that caddis fly in that structure right there. So we got a uh, little 2.2 .2 mule minnow tied on. Maybe they just want the caddis fly. It's a possibility. Keep moving. Looks so good here though. There's a fish. What is this? That a it's a trout, guys. All right, brownie. We know there's trout in here, all right. That's wild too. Figured there would be, because the water's so cold. I'm gonna keep them in there though. Here he goes. 
All right, there's trout here, guys. I mean, the water is probably high 50s. First one of the day. Just like under that debris there and kind of bring it back to me. There's another fish, guys. Yeah, that's a rainbow this time. All right. Oh, I popped off. Darn. Should I had my net. Yeah, I just let it drift by that debris over there, and he came out of there, I think. Debris pile. There's another fish, guys. Oh, it came off. Trout. Another trout, guys. Darn, he was small. I think it was a brownie. Man, that's two I missed. There's another one. What is this? What is this? Oh yeah, another fish. It's a brownie this time. Cool colorings on this one. Get out one, guys. Number two. This is awesome. I wasn't expecting the trout day. I was expecting a small malt day. There's a couple houses right here. I'm hoping I'm not on private property. I don't see any signs. So. Creek opens up here though, guys. This looks like a deep section. Oh. Be quiet just in case it is private property. Oh my god, this looks so good, guys. Oh my god, it looks so good. We're gonna catch fish in this hole. I can smell it. What this tiny little creek opened up to. Oh, oh my god. Well, we get bit on the first cast. There's a bite, there's a bite. All right. I'm gonna try a pinch crawler.
There's a fish. Yeah, we got a rainbow here, guys. All right. As long as we can land them. Yep, there he goes. He didn't want to be seen. Hopefully I got him on camera. Man, I wish I brought my net. I said I wasn't expecting to catch trout today. Try over in the shade. Once I got in this creek, I would have never thought there would be a spot like this, though. That's why you never know. You gotta, you gotta explore these creeks. Oh, I missed one, guys. Fish right there. Darn, darn, darn. Wasn't very big, but I'm gonna put a flow down. I'm getting bit, but they're top, top, tops. All right, so here's what we got. We have that same pinch crawler. We got a little float tied on right here. Let's give it a shot. Like I said, they're just kind of nibbling on it. Got him. See, guys? We throw the float down, we catch one. All right. He was just tapping at it. Let's check him out here. There he is right there, guys. A little brownie. Hook came right out. All right. See you, buddy. And it was first cast with a little float tied on here. You went from 20 to 24 inches right here. That's awesome. But yeah, he kept tapping, tapping, tapping. This thing has seen better days, but we're gonna keep using it. Oh man, I just had one, guys. I start right back in there. Thought it was hung up, but it's definitely a bite. My lure's gone. Switch the color here, okay, so you get smart. Got him. Little guy. Who is that? It's a brookie. All right. I've got a brook trout. Wet my hands here. How about that? Was not expecting a brookie today. See, dude. Perfect cast. Got one. Small, what is this? Another brookie? Another brookie, guys. Look at that fish. Oop. There he goes. All right. Two brook trout. Two brookies, guys. Would have never thought I was gonna catch a brook trout today, or a brown trout, or a rainbow trout. That's how fishing is, you know? You start fishing one spot, think you're gonna catch a totally different species, 
then you're like, eh, I almost called it a day. I almost went home. I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna stop at this creek here. Down this side of the creek, it looks pretty deep right here. Oh yeah. Just walked through it. Whoa! Wow! Big crawfish right there. Got one. What do I got this time? Oh, that's a rainbow. It's a nice rainbow. Nice fish. Best one of the day right here. Come here, buddy. Don't break me off. What a fish. What, a, what an awesome day. You guys, if you made it this far in the video, please smash that thumbs up for me. It really helps me out here. It's gonna do it. We ended up having a really, really good day here on the creek. Um, I started off with the Meal Mental 2.2 and then I switched it up to a gulp pinch crawler. I think I might have caught maybe two fish on the mule minnow. I got snagged and I'm like, oh, I'm gonna try something different. And I'm glad I did. And I don't know how many, I probably caught what, eight to 10 trout today. If you guys wanna see possibly maybe a catch and cook on the creek, let me know. Could definitely cook something up down here. That's how fishing is. You, th you think you're gonna go for one species and then it just doesn't always work that way. The plan was to do a video on smallmouth on the river and then that failed. I seen this little creek here on Google Maps. I'm like, oh, I'll stop here. And I slayed them. Like I said, I caught maybe eight to 10 trout. A few of them are decent size. I think they're all stocked. I've, I think the first one I caught, I said it was probably wild, but I don't think, I think they were, these were all stocked trout. And like always guys, thanks for watching. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and maybe think about subscribing if you haven't already. Thank you and have a great day.